Hello my fellow survivors, Kyliru here and welcome back to State of, State of Decay Breakdown. This is level 7 and part 61. Okay, so we, I think, have only got one more thing left to do with the RV and that's repair the engine. So, that's all that queued, so we've got 30 minutes to wait before that is done. Okay. Cuts down gunshot noise. Attitude. Oh, I see. Attitude charitable. Okay, fair enough. Right. Well, good. We got some. We got some suppressors. Awesome. That's 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 good to know. Yeah. Okay. So we can set up traps. We're going to make some more snacks and set up some more suppressors. So we've got 16 beds and eight labour, a population of nine. So we're going to have some decisions to make when we think about moving on to level. Eight, level eight, yeah. <laughs> I was going to say level 40, but no, that's not the case at all. Okay, so we've got a scavenger mission over here. So let's go find out who this is and what they want. Uh, we've got a decent gun. Is there... What bullets does it take? Three, five, seven. Do we have a... What guns do we have that take three, five, seven? We've got a pistol. I like a... So the fires a bit more quickly than this bolt action or lever action rifle. What have we got then? So there was that pistol which I might switch out to. Oh, there's that M1 carbine. Uh, that's another sort of gun along the same sort of lines, isn't it? Well, let's get rid of that one. Let's grab this pistol. Where is it? Yeah, okay. Oh, it's this thing. Use that one with another survivor. Okay, so we are going to make some space, though. Let's drop those off. We'll keep the fire. So we're going to find out who this is and what they want help picking up. Enjoy. You're not going to be able to pop his head, but never mind. Okay, this car is the least fucked. Does it have a lot of shit in the boot? Time to check this out. I hear ya. Because there's a Clio mission down this way as well. And I know I said I wouldn't do it, but... I might nip over there and see what I can grab. So we'll just drop this stuff off in the boot of this piggy truck for now. Let's go find out who this scavenger is and what they want help with then. I think we've got to go right and then right. Well, right onto the highway and then it's left a bit further down. Oh dear me. So, uh, we've had a productive day today. We put some furniture together and we've got all of our books set up, which is nice. I managed to put out some of my pop vinyls and things, so yeah. I've been having trouble getting the display port to work on my computer though, or, or I was having trouble finding a display port adapter so I can run it with two monitors and keep the SLI bridge from my graphics cards. Um, but I think it's because basically my monitors won't run with display ports adapters, so I might need to upgrade them. So I can just plug them directly into this display port rather than having a HDMI display port adapter. But I can't afford to do that this week. <laughs> Okay, so we are turning left up here. Nearly, I'm not sure whether I've actually been up this way. Well, I must have done, must have done at some point. No, Mr. Bloater, not today. Bloaters kind of remind me of Plague Bearers from Games Workshop. Rather appropriate as well. Juggernaut. Okay, so what else is up here? You're, you're outside? No, you're in a tiny ass shed. Where's that juggernaut? Not near here, okay. 
Are you here to help? Yeah, all right. Okay, loading up. Might as well see whether we can grab anything. Nope, don't want that backpack. Nope, fine. Yeah, we'll hurry up. Almost done. Good. A lot of this looks like food day. Ah. Yeah, you can fucking help. Fight to level four. Only level four for Milo. Really? Watch the right. Snacks created. Good. Get in here. More snacks, please. Plug the door with the bodies. Not a bad shout. Okay. So the clear mission is over there somewhere. Alright then. Get in the car. Get in the car. Where are we taking you? Over there. Well, you know what I'm going to do actually? The clear mission, I think, is over here. Down there. Think. Doesn't look too bad. Let's see whether I'm just going to scout the area out. Farmers market, shit like that. It was holistic, pesticide-free, and lovingly hand-picked by hippies on a commune somewhere. I wouldn't need it. Man, my grocery runs took two hours, and I could have just zipped Oops. down to the tartan mart up the block. I was making it. <sighs> okay, I was a smug, elitist foodie, and I'm pretty sure all my friends wanted to throttle me whenever I said the word party. Hell. Yeah. I now can cheat, look, because I can raid this without having to deal with the zombies. And it's actually good oh, stuff. We'll okay, so this is actually going to be worthwhile. I did this before. I managed to basically glitch the clear mission by raiding the place while I was on another mission, which meant it wasn't completely swarming with zombies. And I managed to get the stuff. It is kind of cheating and I do feel a bit bad about it, but not really. Okay. I'm a cheating little bastard. And I don't care. Nice. <laughs> Let's make me a bad person. Right, let's get out of here then, now that I've cheated the game. <laughs> okay, um, do I need to feel bad about doing that? I really do not like doing clear missions. I think, for, whoa, for what you get out of them, they aren't really worth it. You watch, the game's going to punish me now by glitching out and I'm going to lose all this stuff I've got. Okay, let's see whether we can get you home without crashing too much. Cross country it is then. Go, go, go. Where the even the fuck? Oh, McCready's farmhouse. Okay. Fuck a duck. Probably would have thrown a tire if I'd done that in real life. Where's the front? I don't even remember. It's this way. Fuck, that's a lot of zombies. Better get ready. Yeah, you better. Let's uh, just get inside, shall we, for the time being. Anna. F 
fucking really. Die. Die. Die, zombies. Hold on to your speech, Rana. Believe in the power of the Grundle. All right, now you're fucking off. All done. Charming. I think this guy was we owe you. Okay. What's the latest? Fuel, course? sweet. Rucksack's full, so I'm heading back. We'll be ready. You're still there. Uh... So I think that was indicating that we are missing something for the RV. So what are we missing? Rotary tool. Why do we need a rotary tool for the RV? Isn't that something that you used to till the ground with? I don't know what a rotary tool is. Okay. Barbecued crispy zombie. Right, so we've got to get home now without dying. And we've got a fear itself mission. Ooh, we could combine that with getting the rotary tool. So we'll have some backup. Okay, again, I know people have said that there's an annoying wiring noise, and I'm very sorry about that. I'm working to resolve the problem. I am teaching myself uh, how to uh, use Audacity to clean up audio recordings. So I'm going to start recording audio and gameplay footage separately, because at the moment my game capture card captures both. Um, and then what I can do is I can edit the... Uh, I can edit the video... The audio, sorry, I distracted myself and went completely the wrong way. Um, I can edit the audio over the top of the video uh, using Filmora, maybe, or um, uh, some other such application. So bear with me, I am working on the problem, so I'm very sorry, I will, I will let you know when I believe I've resolved the issue, and then you guys can give me feedback about whether you think it's completed or not. Uh, complete it. I'm very tired. Whether you think it's good enough. <laughs> it's very warm in here. Maybe I should have opened a window before I started recording. Okay, so we're going to go to this roaster tool and do the fear itself mission, and we will then hopefully be able to move on to uh, break down level 8. Nearly there. So it's the next right. Wiggly wiggly woo. Is that it's got the fear itself mission this time. There you go. Right, so what did we actually place. get? Sweet. Grenade launcher. Whoa. I likes me a grenade launcher. Let's drop some of the shit off anyway. Straight in trouble. Could use our help. Oh, fuck a duck, really? Looks like we're going to have a couple of uh, missions to do. <laughs> Next video, if we decide we can be bothered. Oh, really? Right, let's um, drop those off. Take that out, because that's just using up space. Destroy. Put that in. Take out one of those. Small snacks. The rest of these bullets. Still a few bits to grab from the boot of the car, I think. Keeping that grenade launcher. Let's see whether we can find a place to stash that grenade launcher. Might use these frag grenades on this horde. Come on, zombies. Boom! <laughs> one grenade, one horde. Awesome. I like it. Uh, 
Okay. So we need to get rid of something. Right, and then there was um, there was a silencer in there. That was it. It was the silencer, and we want that. Let's find out who's this fear itself mission for then. Who is you, bruh? Brady. Why don't we get out of here? Mole house. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to borrow Brady because we want to go see whether we can find this rotary tool that for some reason the RV needs. And we're going to go over here. So now we've got to listen to Brady bitch about how crap it is surviving the zombie apocalypse. But to be honest with you, I think he can just suck it up. Because he ain't dead. That's a feral. Where even are this place? Maybe fuel. Not that we really need any. Have a look. Yep. Coming in with a full pack. We'll be ready. Oh, that. Fuck that is a feral. Get in the car, Brady, 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 Brady. Get in the car. Oh, you are so lucky. Can I squash that? Thank you. Faces, people! Shut your face, man. Where'd you get off making all the noise? A flying fucking army zombie out of nowhere. Shoot you in the bloated butthole. Okay. If there's more fuel here, I might just leave it here. No, nothing, okay. Oh, straight out of the door. Armored zombie. Heads up. We got zombie activity three o'clock. Well you're a big boy, you can take a zombie, can't you? Apparently not. Okay, so, rotary tool might be in here. There is a zombo over there. Rotary tool acquired, along with some construction materials. So let's get out of here. Actually, let's search this first. Take those. Those will be useful for me to has. So, fear itself, mission A. Let's listen to you bitch about how crap life is. Could be worse, I could gaffer tape you to a tree. You know, use you as a distraction for the zombies. Oh, do we need to go home? Oh. No, okay. There was a zombie horde attacking home and the tra it hadn't triggered the traps for whatever reason. But. I got the notification to say that it had, so it looks like it's all been taken care of now. You're not going to complain at us? Eighteen minutes. We've just got enough time to finish this mission off because it's quite close to home. Getting some fresh air and a change of scenery. Damn right. do you good. See, the thing is, is Milo sounds so sarcastic every time he opens his mouth. The same as his brother. Okay, so we've got some bonus points for doing that, which is good. Right, let's get some practice in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Just running zombies over with a car count as hand-to-hand combat. Do you reckon? Maybe not, but that's what's going to happen. Oh, fuck a duck, really? I've not seen that happen before. That was a mistake, I think. Oh, shit, son. Get down. Get off of Brady, you bunch of whack wankers. Okay, pop a snack. Really, dude? Come on. 
die. You can die too. Really? Go. Right. Smashing up Zeds always makes you feel better. Good. Finally, thing just done. Good. Let's get out of here before that juggernaut notices us and wants to come and eat us. And there's a feral and a screamer and there are armored zombies and bloaters and all that sort of shit. That help at all? The folks here, they've got your back. You just gotta give them a chance to show it. Yeah. Okay. I guess so. Yeah, son. So suck it up. We're all in this together and shit. Good to hear. So Milo's actually a little more sympathetic than his brother. This bag's really fucking heavy, so how about a thank you? Oh, I can repair the doors on that car, can I? Oh yeah, I need a machine shop though. Is there any point in upgrading it? Because we're gonna be moving on soon. Probably not. Scratch that off the wish list. Okay then. So, not a bad episode as episodes go. We are running low on ammo that we have for guns that we actually want to keep. Um, so yeah, we helped someone do a scavenge mission. We managed to raid a clear mission secretly uh, without actually activating the clear mission, which is a bit cheaty, but uh, I don't like doing them at the best of times, so I don't really feel that bad about it. Um, and we did a first self mission, got the rotary taller, and so we are, are doing the final work on the RV to move on to level 8. So hopefully next video we can move on uh, up to the next level and break down. Um, as always, you know, if you, if you like the video, if you like what I'm doing, drop a comment, give it a thumbs up, let me know what you would do, let me know what I could be doing different, um, maybe... Uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed, uh, share the video with someone else you think might enjoy it. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and as always, God bless and keep gaming.